Hello and welcome to Cool Stuff at Dunwoody. I'm William from Marketing and we are off campus today. I am here at Upanor, which manufactures tubing that is used in radiant uh, heating and cooling systems. And I'm here with um, a bunch of HVAC and HASD students and with Chuck and George. Say hi, everybody. Hi. hi. <laughs> All right. And <laughs> Steve Swanson from Upanor is going to Swanson from Upanor is going to give us a demonstration on how you do a coupling. Okay, I'll just demonstrate quickly how to, how you make a PEX connection. As you notice, what we're using is a PEX ring to make the connection. We're not using a metal ring, which could uh, rust or break later on. We use the same lifespan material as the tubing we make. We just put the PEX tubing down over the coupling over the expansion ring over the tubing and you can see it slides down until it's done and we this is a hand expander we make sure the head is on tight and I'll, I have a coupling here can you hold that just a second what I do is I put the I hold my hand out here on the on the end of the wrench to get good leverage I put it on my hip and watch this I'll expand it all the way down then all the way back up and then I rotate the expander one eighth turn then I'll expand it again. The reason I'm doing that is to make sure that the expansion doesn't get any channeling going on where leaks could possibly take place. And I just go like that, and I expand it all the way out, just like that, and I take my little coupler, in this case, and stick it in. Now you'll see that it visibly matched the end there, it, so it's a visual connection. This is 100% in right now, and this is the weakest this joint will ever be. From now on, it's getting stronger and stronger and stronger. I could burst test this right now to 150 PSI. That's pretty impressive. That, is that a new watt? That's a new watt. So you took that with it. You guys know what solder is like. First you stick your hand down in the bucket so you can find that little wire brush. And you know when you find it because your hand hits it. Oh, that hurts like crazy. Then you take the little pinhole leak that was in there and you put it in the flux. And that burns like crazy. right? And then you flux it all up. You clean it. Then you solder that all together. And you hope that the solder joint works because you're not sure till you do what. You got to add the water. Then you find the leak you were looking for. This is 100% visual. If this shoulder matches this tubing, it's done. You never have to worry about it leaking. And this joint, this particular connection in this thing has a 25 year warranty. I can direct bury this connection under cement. It's just fine. Isn't that great? Think you can make one? Well, we'll let anybody here, I'll give you another demonstration. And that's cool stuff at Dunwoody.